Seagrasses have been decimated around the UK. We think that the UK has lost at least 90% of its seagrass. So it remains a, um, a scattered, fragmented habitat uh, that used to be a very dominant part of the, of the coast of the UK. Last summer, we went out to places all around the UK and we went collecting seeds. the problems of high tidal currents, of uh, animals wanting to eat those seeds, we, we came up with the idea of using a, um, a pretty simplistic um, little bag, the sort of uh, hessian bag that your sort of Christmas soap gets uh, uh, packed in and yeah, uh, sure. gets a little bow on it. Right. To make sure they're nicely topped up with sand. That's roughly about 50 individual seeds. <laughs> allowed them to naturally degrade, which is what happens in the wild, and generally the, the viable seeds that are, are more likely to germinate and be successful would sink to the bottom. We face a, a growing climate emergency and we, we have to make important and rapid steps as a planet to fight that emergency. Seagrasses store vast amounts of carbon in their sediments and they do that very, very rapidly. It's where it can stay and remain locked away for millennia. We also face a, a biodiversity emergency where all populations of all major animals and plants on this planet are in decline. Oh. 